Once again, here is my colleague and social media reporter, Mariama Diallo. Mariama. Thanks, Shaka. As Kenyans prepare to vote in the national elections on March 4th, recent opinion polls suggest the presidential race is extremely tight. This year's elections are the first under the new 2010 constitution, which introduced major political reforms after the 2008 post-election violence. The too close to call race leads us to our question of the week for today's program. How confident are you that Kenya's Electoral Commission can hold free, fair, and credible elections? Send an email to Africa TV at voanews.com or post your comment on our Facebook page, keyword Straight Talk Africa. As we encourage you to join our Facebook page, the two leading candidates have attracted uh, themselves a huge amount of fans on Facebook as well. Raila Odinga has nearly 81,000 followers, while Uhuru Kenyatta has a whopping 420,000 followers. Meanwhile, on Twitter, Mr. Odinga has almost 114,000 followers, while Mr. Kenyatta has nearly 105,000 followers. We thought we will check the social media front for you guys. Now let's go to our comments, beginning with Egia Benle from the Ghana Institute of Languages, who writes, if Kenyans believe that the best candidate will win, there will be no cause for alarm. Neither will there be pressure on its electoral commission. Our second comment comes from Sandra Medi in Lilongwe in Malawi. She says, after what happened last election, I have no confidence at all. The problem is not the Electoral Commission, but the Kenyans themselves. Tribalism, she says, is too deep-rooted in Kenya. Well, Shaka, Electoral Commission or not, these two comments put the responsibility into the hands of the Kenyan people.